So we're here today in Phoenix, Arizona to check out Jack and Jill's Haunted Hill haunted attraction that we have here. We're here with Jackson, who is the owner and operator of it. Why don't you tell us a little bit about the place? Well, this is our fifth season as Jack and Jill's Haunted Hill. Uh, it did start off as a family friendly, just in a neighborhood for the neighborhood kids to come through our haunt. Just kind of blew up and eventually got shut down, leading to the opening of a more um, adult entertainment style haunted house, a little more gory, and um, uh, so, so it's our, our second commercial season. It's very actor based, no animatronics, it's more of a continuous story that uh, we invite people to come be a part of a cinematic journey, uh, of more of like a psychological thriller than your average boo hot, scary house that they okay. normally go through. So very theatrical, you try to bring your guests into almost a, what's like a play. Right, exactly, just like a play. Um, we have them come be a part of the scene, be immersed in the world. We want it to feel like you're in a movie set, that the, the world around you is, is actually alive. It's something that you can actually be a part of, it can really happen, and um, we just really emerge people into that. Um, another kind of new thing this year is we do have featured victims and killers, different models throughout. Um, the Phoenix area that we've invited to come out to be a part of, of something a little bit different this year. Cool, and we have one of those people here tonight. Right, I yes, uh, Rochelle Hoffman. Uh, she will be here tonight. You guys will get to meet her in a little bit. Awesome. Um, she's a, um, she's, she's great. She's got a huge following and we're really happy to have her be a part of it tonight. That sounds great. Now I did hear you say before, it's more, you, it used to be more of a family oriented attraction, but looking at some of the scenes here, maybe uh, right, right, maybe not so. Yeah, uh, you know, it was <laughs> <laughs> it was made it was made uh, for for kids to kind of walk through, and we had a bunch of Halloween stuff, and that Halloween stuff has in, evolved into more of a realistic setting and feeling. Um, that we just invite people to come be a part of. Awesome, that sounds great. Well, we're looking forward to going through it later. I'm sure we're gonna get the uh, crap scared out of us. Right, we hope so. Bluntly. We hope so. <laughs> and what would, uh, it, it would not be Jack and Jill's Haunted Hill without the uh, well here. It right, was, right, you, you know, know, that's what led them up here. They came to find the water and they found this lovely house when they reached the well and. Um, a lot more, they found a lot more <laughs> than, than what they were. Uh, right, 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 so I mean, Hopefully you guys will be lucky enough to make it out alive. Awesome. Well, we're looking forward to it. Thanks right. a lot. Thank you. So we all know the nursery rhyme of Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill, they go up a hill and they fetch a pail of water. Well, this isn't like that Jack and Jill. This is more like Jack and Jill, they both get killed and I get the crap scared out of them. So without further ado, let's go ahead and check this out. You guys ready? Come on, let's go.